With South Bend's Mayor Pete rising in the polls, a lot of people are wondering about his chances. 13 on your side, Sarah Makuta spoke to some young voters to get their takes on the also young candidate. He's not the most experienced top-tier Democratic presidential candidate, yet Pete Buttigieg continues to hold on to fourth place in the 2020 nomination race. So what's his appeal? Ben Gritter attends Calvin University. 2020 will be the first presidential election he's old enough to vote in. I think overall Americans are, are kind of numb to the like absurdity of this administration, and in order for the, the Democrats to, to win in this upcoming presidential election. They really need to put forward a candidate who can appeal to uh, a whole range of voters. And Nathan Jindra is a political science student who sees Pete Buttigieg as a strong alternative to frontrunner Joe Biden. He has this appeal to like older sort of college educated whites, which is the base I think he's kind of digging into in Iowa and these other places. Last week an Iowa poll showed him in first place in the first in the nation caucus nine points ahead of his nearest competitor, Elizabeth Warren. I was not like a lot of America. One, it's far more white. There are very few racial or ethnic minorities. Two, um, it's pretty well educated. It's one of the best educated uh, states in the, in the nation. Mm -hmm. And three, the, the way you campaign in Iowa is very much of a small town retail campaigning door to door or small town to small town. It's really the way a mayor campaigns for, for mayoral office. Tonight's debate is a moment for Mayor Pete to prove he has the staying power to remain in the game. Sarah Makuda, 13 on your side.